Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. On today's video I'm going to do to I'm going to um bring to you guys a product review. Um and always remember the whatever I say in this video is solely my opinion. So don't take it personal. Um you can always order it and buy it yourself and try it. Um, but I'm just going to get my honest feedback and just be done with it. So, but before we uh, do this product review, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all of those good things. And also hit the notification bell to be notified every time I decide to upload a crazy video for you guys. And on today's video... The product that I'm going to be reviewing is the Jamaican Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Edge Treatment, which is this. And I'm going to try to put a picture. Probably it's going to be my um, thumbnail or something. But I'm going to tell you guys that this has shea butter in it, peppermint, and apple cider vinegar, right? So, to me, it's very liquefied. <clears throat> it's, 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 it's very liquefied. Um, and I don't think, honestly, I don't think it is. I'm going to say I don't think it's something. If you're going to slick your sides or your edges down, this is probably not. The best uh, edge uh, control for you, but if you just gonna make a quick ponytail and slick everything up, well, I'm not even gonna say slick everything up. I'm just gonna say everything combed up. Then this probably will help you out a little bit. Um, but you have to understand when you get in the sun, it tends to melt. Like it tends to turn into a uh, grease. So, um, and I kept this, uh, so I could do the product review on it, but honestly, I'm going to throw it away, um, uh, because for me, it, it doesn't work. Um, I can say it'll probably give you more edges, but the thing about that is, you have to constantly wash your hair if you're going to use this because it's sticky. So, you know, everything that flies outside is probably going to stick to your hair. So, I'm not going to say that um, that is, is, is always going to work. But, I mean, it works somewhat. But if you're going to work in a warehouse or something and you just want to put your hair up in a ponytail and make sure... Um, that it, it works throughout the day. This probably is not the, the edge control for you. But it do not have surface parabens. Um, and it don't have, um, prop, propylene, uh, glycol. Um, it doesn't have mineral oil. And it's not animal tested. And it don't have petroleum. But the thing about it is, it do feel like it got some kind of grease in it. So, um, and I guess it's the black castor oil and shea butter. But to me, it's not, it, it doesn't, it doesn't work. Um, and I tried it to, I at least tried over half of the bottle. And I'm thinking to myself, okay, well, maybe it does work. But... I tried to go in like harsh treatments like the sun, um, me working in the warehouse when I was working in the warehouse, and it just doesn't work. So, um, you could try it yourself. I got it off Amazon, I believe, but you can also go in the store and buy it. And um, if I had a knew that, I would have got it out the store and bought it and tried it before I bought it on Amazon. But, um, it's always in the store on the hair uh, products aisle, whatever aisle it is. Um, just try it because 
or an offline, it's okay. But I feel like you'll save that money on shipping and handling and all of that stuff. And you just try it out yourself. Um, it do come in a four ounce bottle. And I'm pretty sure it's probably going to be like seven, eight dollars. So, and, and I'm going to show you guys how it looks. So when you go in the store, you can purchase it yourself. And then the bottle looks like this. And you can tell I kept it over a period of time just so I could do the, um, just so I could do this review for you guys. And after this review, I'm, I'm going to throw it away. I promise you I am. But, um, another thing that I bought that I'm not pretty sure works, um, but honestly, to get it to lather, you have to use a lot of it, honestly. Um, and I'm going to tell you guys that I just bought this like a couple of weeks ago. And I only used it. Well, no, I bought it back in June, I want to say. And I only used it twice. Um, and it's the same thing. Um, but it's the shampoo version of it. It's the Jamaican... Black Castor Oil Strengthening Restore Shampoo. And it also has a uh, shea butter, peppermint, and apple cider vinegar in it. And it's also made for uh, cleansing and nourishment. And then it is also, and it don't have none of that stuff in it. And it's also sulfate free and color safe. And you can also use it on natural and chemical processed or heat styled hair. Um... But, I don't know if it works because I just bought it. But, this is the bottle it comes in. And, as you guys can see, it's very liquidy. Um, so, yeah. This is how it looks. And, it says that the shield butter is deep and moisturized while conditioning hair and scalp. Jamaican castor oil is loaded with proteins, minerals, and vitamin E for healthy looking hair. And peppermint invigorates the scalp with a tingling experience. Honestly, it doesn't make your hair tingle, so get rid of that. Um, <clears throat> and it does, and you, it says you have to wet your hair, massage your roots, ends, rinse through the repeat necessary. And then, um, I don't have the conditioner, so I'm thinking about buying the conditioner and trying them both together just to see like which one works and which like does it work or not because usually when you buy the shampoo by itself it really doesn't work because you have to have his brother or sister with it so i'm going to get the conditioner now if i go get the conditioner or if i purchase the conditioner on amazon and it doesn't work then i'm going to tell you guys that this product doesn't work with the conditioner or without but I know for sure I used it twice and it doesn't work well by itself. You have to have some sort of condition to hold on to it. So, um, yeah, it's probably not a good product by itself. Um, you can always get a shield moisture or some kind of conditioner that shield moisture. Um, but it's, it's good for what it's worth. Um, I think what it is, she and most of the products just don't work for my hair at all. Um, I think that's what it is. And I think, I'm not, honestly, I can't even say that I'm going to buy the conditioner. Because if you guys don't know, I bought a conditioner already. And it was up in my, um, in my crazy haul that you probably, yeah, you probably already got that haul. But, um, and it was called the Mini Dollar Tree haul, wasn't it? I think I put it in that Mini Dollar Tree haul where I said I cheated. So what, um, is in that haul. But I recently bought the conditioner that I know helps my hair out a lot. And I'm pretty sure it's probably old because it was a company back in the 1930s. Um, but... 
it really helps my hair. Um, so yeah, and it's this cholesterol queen Helen um conditioner, hair conditioning cream, and it's for over dry, over processed hair. And then the thing about it is, my hair is not over pro over processed. It just whoo dry, like uber dry. Um. So yeah. I'm going to try it and see does it work. Um, I might try these, the shampoo and this other conditioner together just to see if it works or not. If it do work, I'm going to let you guys know that you can try this together. The Shea Butter and Helen together and be done with it. But that's all I came to you guys for today. Um, I'm going to clean up i'm going to eat breakfast which is a banana and some ginger ale because my stomach is not settling this morning i don't know why um and then i'll make me a smoothie and then hopefully i can get straight to work and be done with that um and hopefully i don't have to go in today hopefully i can just do everything from home um but i probably will have to go in because i have to get some stuff done at work but yeah so yeah that's what I wanted to show you guys also I wanted to show you guys um the um what's the name of this thing the amount that I had bought the smaller version of it um yeah so it's this mount and this where the phone goes, of course, or your camera, of course. And then the legs on it. And you can tell I could be using it because the legs is going anyway. But um, this is the, the amount I was using in the car. And someone told me you can actually use it in the car. You just have to find some way to prop it up in there and let the legs completely out on it. But... I don't know. I see what I can do with that. Um, if I can find a way and it doesn't flip the phone or anything, then yeah, I will use it. And you guys will receive more vlogs from me. But if it doesn't do what it's supposed to do, then um, I just won't. I just won't do vlogs for you guys because I need a mount that's going to actually work. Someone said I can buy one that actually sticks in the CD, uh, the CD player uh, slot, but I don't know about that. But we'll see what I can do. Um, I don't think I want to buy another one, but I'm going to look it up and see how much another one costs. Um, if you guys got any suggestions on any amounts that you think I should buy, because I mostly use this one to broadcast at home. But if you guys know any others I can use, then just let me know in the comment section below or link it below or something like that. But anyways, this is the end of this video because you guys know I could talk on and on and on and show you guys everything in my room that I had got uh, recently, but I'm not going to do that. Uh, but what I am going to do, make sure you watch my next shopping haul for uh bath and body works and other things that i went and got um so yeah i'll see you guys in my next video make sure you like comment subscribe all of those good things and don't forget to leave a comment please um <clears throat> also don't forget to hit the notification bell to be notified every time i decide to put up a crazy video and um yeah i'll see you guys in my next video and if it's the weekend for you like it almost is for me, thank God. Um, be safe. Spend much time you can with your family. And, yeah. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.